check this out, huh? This is for Damien. Wait, where is it? So look. Stupid kid. Look what he's going to do. Damien! Ah. Uh, is he he gets cuckoo over something, you know? This is his game. Look at it. Okay, wait. It's kind of funny, but he's not doing it correct. Because he used to... Oh. Okay, wait a minute. This is funny, so wait a minute. I will do it here first. So you see, it's because I wax, I make the floor really, really shiny. I am planning to wax it. Okay, look at it, huh? Okay, look at what will happen. <laughs> he slides over wait a minute again 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 it's really funny okay wait a minute look he's getting ready so i will aim there ah stupid ah he didn't saw it oh he's already full because actually i just feed feed him so, okay, I have to do the boxes, but I have to wash first because now I am going to make coffee. I'm going to chill and relax. Damien, come here. So, yes, I will give him later this one, the remaining one. Uh, but you didn't saw it. It used to be really, really funny when he gets to... to to slide on the floor because it's just too slippery for him but ah uh, Damien come kitty catch you come 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 yeah he's chill now there he will not move now come here Damien I hate you okay wait a minute let's go see and then because I have, I need to finish what I'm doing. I need to, I need to finish washing coronavirus pandemic in India. Well, it is what it is. You never listen. So now, yes, you're shouting for help. It is what it is as well. But since the fact that you never listen to the advice of the WHO, you never listen to the advices of a lot of country, a lot of world nonsense. So, well. It's really sad and you know I I get it. But this you know this it's it happened because you didn't take precaution. You had the election after the other, the rally in the street, well not including the religious views, so that is also a big question mark because religious are the religion, you know, they this is what they do all their lives. But then this is not just any other year. This is a pandemic year. The death, the angel of death is taking us one by one. Mama Mia, it's called the global pandemic for a reason. <laughs> and this one, oh shit. Um, what is happening? Fans show support ahead of man. UT, UTD clash. What is this? Wait, let's, let's. Ah, okay, it is the Europe Europa Football League. Oh, you see that? Damien get crazy. So this is because of this, yes. This, you know, football is very big here in Europe. Yes, it's like next to hockey. I love hockey. I am into ice hockey now. I am the, my team is Ben. Yeah, I think my team is Ben. Because of the costume. And I like the top player there, the high scorer. And I like the costume because it has a yellow helmet with fire. And the t-shirt from the bear has a fire with, with a bear. I, th I don't remember. But then the number seven. I watched the live show from the football, uh, from the ice hockey. And they were fighting and they were time out in the dock for two minutes so they cannot play and they were that number seven his name was um i forgot but i know him because he was like he was the one who in instigated the fight and it was like a lot of testosterone going in the ice hockey 
And you have to win Hamilton in Formula 1 because I have a bet running. You know, this bet is a huge bet. So if I win, I got to watch the ice hockey free. My daddy will pay. And if I lose, I have to pay. So you have to win. <laughs> You know, you have to win the champion. You have to be number one because I don't want to be buying the ticket for a live hockey game because I have to be buying this. If I lose, it is a bet. You know, a bet is a bet. But it's not like now, now, you know, because it's still pandemic. We cannot go to the live events and sports. But if you lose, I have to buy the ticket. So you don't lose ha Hamilton, okay? You have to win for me. And if, if daddy lose, then he have to buy the ticket for the live ice hockey, you know, because it is the bet. You know, we don't bet money, we bet for tickets, we bet for whatever. Me and daddy, we always have these bets, you know, then we, egal was, anything, you know. Sometimes, a bet is a bet, you know, we are gamblers, I think. It, we have been doing bets for like 11, running 11 years. Well, not for, for, not for when I run away because I run away again. I'm a runaway child. I always running, running, running. <laughs> okay, bye-bye. Now I have to finish my washing and make my coffee. And it's because I am here, you see. I am here lying down. And I have to do a lot of nonsense. Blazy Stoner and the Damien Raketsu. Well, he didn't do the, a good job with whatever it is I was trying to show you because this is the game that we used to play, me and my cat. But now he's in the kitchen. I hear him drinking water. I hear he, he's back now. Damian, I love you. Come to mama. I love you, Damian. Come here. Also, say goodbye to the camp now. You are not a famous cat, but you are a lovely cat. You know? Well, the other cat that I used to follow, he's dead now. Yeah, he... I forgot the name of the cat. I think... I also follow before Grumpy Cat, but I think Grumpy Cat is... I don't know what happened to Grumpy Cat. I don't see him much often. But gr Grumpy Cat is... I follow him for 11... For, for Since I arrived to Switzerland... So maybe the cat is not yet anymore. I don't see him. And there is the... Si, si, I am following Simon's cat and the other cat that makes videos and films. Um, what is this cat name? He have a lot of film, these cats, because his owner likes to make videos of him. And he's really, really funny. And this, the owner is a guy who makes short films from his cat. And it's really, really funny because he makes... He makes a lot of, um, of, you know, costumes and not costumes, but stories. And, okay, yeah, the religious. Okay, let's go back to the CNN. Global report underway to get help to India. Yeah, it's too late. It's now the help is not going to get there very soon. A lot of people will be falling down. The angel of death is, is busy, you know. Angel of Death is busy collecting the the people that is because it happened to them because they didn't listen. I already knew that this was happen. I already know. Hello. Mm. And you know, just just. Just listen. Don't be so relaxed because this pandemic, this Verona, ah, Verona, this Corona is really like you don't even you don't see it coming. You don't even know that he is around the angel of death, the virus. You don't even know that you're talking to that person, and then all of the sudden, three, two, three, four days, you are already infected with a virus, and then you infect one more, and then one more, and then pack duck. Oh, look, 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 let's go. <laughs> Crematorium operating around the clock and it's like, a, oh man. And I don't want, you know, one of my ideal jobs is to work in the cemetery. 
or to in the crematorium or whatever i kind of like working with dead people it's not it's not a way of disrespecting them i just wanted to work there because i have the the stomach for this but now i don't want to work for you fuck that man no way no way will I want to work in a fucking funeral home now because of the corona. And because we all know, before I used to want it to work for you, but not anymore. Fuck duck. Oh, no. Hell no. Even if you hire me now. No, no, no. Why the hell would I want to be associated with the people who died from corona? Hell no. Even if you pay me one million. Fuck duck. Not, not, not. Money is not enough for me to be working for you for this. When this people, because I, it was my dream job. I wouldn't, even when I was interviewed in the GMA, you know, I said to them because I wanted to own a funeral shop. I wanted because I know I can give justice to the dead. I am very good in decorations. I am very good in, in funeral services. Why, how can I not be? My mother died. My, I, I had many funeral services that I help through all the years you know i know i'm good in something it's not about whatever whatever it is that you think about me maybe it was it was going to you know i i it, people could have misinterpreted what i was trying to say but even if somebody hire me to work for this service no not now maybe after the corona i can work an, again in a funeral service but not now even if you give me Whatever it is, I will not work for this for now. No! Hmm. So, you see? <laughs> oh, unattended. Nothing. I mean, seriously, who? Uh, is this a crematorium now? It looks like they're cooking people, you know? I, I'm, I, 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 I say it how I see it. You see, the dead is under this fire. It looks like a fucking ba barbecue. I mean, no disrespect whatsoever. I just say what I am looking at. It looks like a fucking barbecue people in the, in the crematorium. I never seen such things like this. Never in my entire life would I ever think that I would witness something so terrible like this. I mean, this is not the way to die and this is not the way to go. Oh. <laughs> Look at you. Look at these people. They are like around the clock and no one, they have to be. And also they are also running out of lands to, de to, to bury the people because not all people are going to be buried in the, cre going to be the crematorium. Ah. Yeah, you said it right. And did you see when people are rushing their patients? their sick people to the hospital they were not even wearing masks i mean i was just like ah i mean i have been watching the coverage from cnn from bbc ah well because i don't have much channel i used to watch the coverage from al jazeera as well i like al jazeera channel and well cnn i'm not a cnn fan but I used to I, I kinda like CNN because I get good coverage here but they come they but the thing here I also like BBC normally that is the cha and Al Jazeera I have three major news channel that I used to watch but I cannot watch Al Jazeera here I don't have Al Jazeera I have um what is the Trump channel Mm. I don't remember, but I have. So, Navalry in court, it's the Russian thing. Appearance, I am a skeleton. Aww. Ah, well, that's the thing. When you protest against the big people, that is what you... You know, it is so hard to to fight the Kremlin. You cannot just fight the strong people in the world. I know it. I got it. Even me, I already have a... Uh, fucking probably read that on the top of my head because I am very very vocal you know I mean like I I always say speak what is in my mind irregardless I know that I shouldn't be saying that but the thing is that is what the world is doing to us the government and the politics that is what is the world is doing to the people this this so if no one is like Navalry you know if no one is going to speak out if no one is going to say something about this, then this will never end. So it's like Navalry. I know he knows that is what is going to happen to him. 
But uh, I think he is prepared. He knows that this will happen to him ahead of time. You know, he, he knows exactly what is going to happen to him. And I think also he even knows that this could cost him his life. I mean, you know, the only reason he is still alive because he is hot in the news. You cannot just kill Navalry just like that because it will ignite a lot of... It will just, you know, but if not... Let this, let this news now cool down. This man is a dead man. He will die from natural, they say natural causes, but not. He will be poisoned. Uh, what, uh, you know, a lot of, there are, they say that there are 101 ways to skin a cat. That, okay. So this, there are like 101 ways to skin Navalry. You know, meaning there are 101 ways, think, you know, how to assassinate him. But the only reason he's is alive because he is very, very hot in the news. You know? You cannot just. We all know this. A lot of people want to stand up for what is wrong about everything. But the reason is, the reason nobody is standing because they have family. You know, the, you know it's, if you are alone, you don't care. You can fight it. No one is going to be assassinated, your family. But once you have a big family, then do you know who will they take first before you? They will... They will kill all your families before they even put you down. That is the thing. You cannot fight because most of the people who wanted to say something, I cannot blaze. I'm so sorry. You know, like, maybe not in this time, in this world. It, it breaks my heart. You know, I get, become, I get very, very emotional because they will always say, Blaze, we are not blind. We see what is happening to the world. But you see, I have a mom, a dad, a brother, a sister, a wife, kids. Do you see the things that I will lose just in case I wanted to support something? You know, to stand up for something. I cannot. In, you know, they cannot. Their mom will be tortured or whoever. You know, they will take one of your family. And if it's not enough, they will take all what you have. And you will be, you know, and then you, they will say you did this to your family. So that is why, why. people... It, regardless, they see whatever is happening to the world, they will never speak up for the sake of their loved ones. And that is the reality of the world. And it is sad but true. <sighs> so, yeah, you know, that's why I say I can say something. I can speak something. I can speak for something that cannot speak for themselves because I ain't got nothing to lose. You know, I, ain't, I don't have anything to lose. But I can... <laughs> I have plenty to gain. I can help people. I can turn my sinking boat around, you know? Because not all sinking boats are not going to... You know, there are still life, even if it looks so dim. As long as that person have that spirit and the courage to fight back for, for whatever they believe in. Then, you know? So you don't think that you cannot do anything good or turn your sinking ship around if you truly mean if you truly mean what 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 if you truly mean that you want to change if you truly mean that you know you want something better for yourself then you know don't the only person that is stopping you to achieve whatever it is is you even if people don't give you a chance, don't give up. Someone will. But these people that will give you a chance, they are not much. You just really have to to try again. And really, because they will, you know, if the universe will set up, it, it, it will set you up in motion. They will, you know, eventually, if you really mean what your heart desire, Miracles can happen. You know, these people will find you. They will give you a, 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 a little bit help to start a new life. Because uh, I believe it, that there are still some people left in this world that have pure hearts. Because, you know, the reason why I am still alive talking to you now is because of these people who helped me along the way. I had uh, fall from my face flat, literally, you know. I have, to, I have been to hell and back, literally, you know. But uh, it's better to have uh, experience everything and 
and and now it's like yes, I have already done everything. What what more can I can I do that? Because it's it's you are the only person who is also capable of restoring yourself to its former glory. You know, you could you could have been just a gunner, but then you have to think. You know, I have tried everything. I have done everything. And there is to me, there is no more thrill in that doing it. It's just like, ah, why, why? You know, I'm the type of person that I at least try it. And then I can, I am, I will be the relevant person that will be saying to you what is the effect and cost and balance of everything because I've been there. Literally, I've done it. Literally, fuck that. So it is what it is. You know, if you need a better person, a person. Who is qualified enough to be talking or to be a good example? It's me. Why? Been there, done that month. And you see, I'm still here, you know, intact with my brain solid. Because with, with what I have done in my life, you know, it would have been only a true strong person can, can go out in the other end of the tunnel. See what I have done, you know, from being so fat. And then I have the motivation to change, to train myself, to push and push and push myself until I get what I want. Ha. So anyway, bye-bye now, Blazy Stoner people. Saving, saving, saving. Namaste. Don't do what mama wouldn't do. And if you do it, keep it in balance. Keep it moderated. Don't just fucking fold your face flat. Use your initiative. Be smart. Stay alive. Love you people. Always don't be afraid to tell that. Don't be afraid to tell other people how you feel. It's better to have said than you have. You know, like maybe you don't have the chance to say it at all because life has no guarantee. People, <laughs> don't waste time trying to find the right moment when that right moment never really, never probably would come. Because I knew I done it. You know, saving my nice clothes for the right occasion. And then I I, I, I grew them. The clothes were not, you know, it was already big in sizes and, and I haven't used them. Even like my pairs of shoes. I have shown you my pairs of shoes in the other room in the first video that I had made today. And it's still a lot here. You know, I have like nearly 250 to 300 pairs of shoes this is just one here i have more so you see it is what it is bye bye now